All right, now, LJ, we're going to see if we still got the echo here. Go ahead and say something. I shouldn't have to direct you. This is a show, buddy. Go, come on, right, keep well, talking. I'm talking, I'm talking. Um, well, do you have a question for me or not? <laughs> no, no, I just wanted to hear some. So did the fine people. Now they, they're regretting it. So, <laughs> All right, let's see what that did. Hello and welcome to Cynical Depression a podcast by Brandon Rudd. You start recording. Hello and welcome to Cynical Depression, a podcast by yours truly, Brandon Rudd. Podcast for degenerates, by degenerates. We talk about this absurdity we call life. Now, let me introduce you to my first guest. We have Leonard. LJ, the off-camera asshole, the wannabe tech guy. Say hello to the people, LJ. How you doing? Uh, yeah, just, I don't know. At a loss for words, it. huh? <laughs> yep. It, does my star shine that bright? Sometimes. 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 Yeah, I thought it might. That's okay. So, a little snowy here today in northwest Ohio, southeast Michigan. You made the drive all the way from Adrian, Michigan. I sure did. Yeah? yeah. How was that? wasn't horrible. Got, wasn't horrible, huh? Got stuck behind one of them salt trucks. That kind of sucked. Well, that's going to fucking ruin your day, yeah, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, let me ask you. Are you a religious man? No. <laughs> no? Okay. Well, then I guess subsequent <laughs> questions do not need to be asked. That's okay. Uh, are you a meme guy? A meme? Yeah, guy? it's kind of like a religion. I, I guess, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Memes are awesome, though, aren't they? Yeah, they're all right. They're all right. Come on. You don't like speaking memes to your buddies over fucking text all day? What do you do if, you, if that's not what you do? Because that's what I do. I mean, sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. Come on. That takes up 90% <laughs> of your day. You're not fucking doing nothing, man. I don't know. I just... It, okay. If not, then where's your ambitions lie? Where do my ambitions lie? Absolutely. When you're outside of work, and what gets you going? Fucking... Probably Fucking that's what we all get off on, man. Come on. What, what, what gets you going? I don't know. I like to sleep and play video games. So you're a lazy piece of shit. I am. That's okay. <laughs> that's okay, man. I mean, I, I've seen a lot of guys like that. And you know, you can't say there's any potential wasted, at least. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So... I really got to know, what's your flavor, man? Like, are you a Bigfoot guy, ghost, conspiracy theorist, something? What's your weird, man? There, there's got to be something. What is your weird? Definitely. I mean, I look into conspiracy theories. Uh, so so you'll, you'll peek down the rabbit hole, but you ain't diving head first in? Yeah, they, they get too deep. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, where, what's your cutoff, man? What, what's your cutoff? Like lizard people drinking fucking young blood? or? I'll listen to all of it. Uh, yeah, okay, <laughs> okay, I, all right. I believe in or not. <laughs> uh, so, okay, so you're more of a uh, conspiracy theorist, not a conspiracy realist. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much, huh? Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's all right. I mean, have you ever seen a ghost? I cannot confirm nor deny. Can't <laughs> confirm nor deny. Okay. Were you on drugs when you seen said ghost? That's why I cannot confirm. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say that's a little bit more of a, a spiritual journey than a haunting, but okay. <laughs> Unless the bad trip just left you fucking reeling, buddy. I don't know. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, you in any sports? You sports guy? No. I didn't think so, man. I, mean, I really just look didn't. at me. I mean. well, no, I don't. But like I told you before, man, the Elvis movie, I, I see it in you minus the good looks, okay? <laughs> but that that's okay. Ain't nothing but a hound dog. <laughs> uh, uh, good shit. So you're a guitar player? Yes. Are you any good? I think I'm decent. Think you're decent. Okay, wait, well, hey, that's good, man. I like confidence. I'm a pretty confident guy myself, you know. Definitely not going to get famous because of it, but. Okay. So speaking of confidence, uh, are you a ladies' man? No. No? Okay, so, so you're, you're more the strong, silent type, or you roll it out by the inch kind of guy? <laughs> well, I, I'm currently dating someone. Oh, that, that's okay. I mean, is it someone, like, as in a him or a her? It's a her. <laughs> 
Is it one of them confirmed hers? Yes. All right. I'm I just, can't confirm that. I'm just making sure. I'm just making sure. I mean, hey, there's nothing wrong with that. It don't work in my house, but it might work in yours. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> Hey, man, whatever you're into, man, that's cool. The world takes all kinds to go around, man. I'm not into sucking dick, but you might be. I know a couple of people who are. <laughs> that's okay. No, man, sometimes my old lady likes suck a little dick every now and then, too. I can't hold it against her, you know. That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, uh, so, anyway, so I- I'm a little disappointed. Uh, we were going to have another guy on today that wasn't our wannabe tech guy. Um, Nick, the receiving guy. We're hoping to get him on the next episode. Um, we call him Nick, the receiving guy, because one, that's his occupation. And two, we don't know his last name. Uh, we'll figure it out, but we'll leave that for the next show because why not? I don't need to investigate till then. Do you? No. <laughs> oh yeah so ah uh, fuck that that's awesome <laughs> well I'm sorry I'm looking through my notes here we're supposed to interview the receiving guy and I got a fucking welder I mean I don't know what, <laughs> you are a welder right like is that your official occupation not really no I mean you just gotta fake it till you make it oh okay. well what is your official occupation I don't have one. you don't have well you are employed though I mean I see you I mean it doesn't mean you're doing nothing when you're there but you are there I mean, I mostly walk around. Pretend like I know what I'm looking for. Well, you know what? (laughs) Uh, The world needs those guys, too, just like they need ditch diggers. You know, I mean, 90% of the world are middlemen, and they do want their cut, regardless of what they fucking don't do, right? Yeah. (laughs) Oh, pay me. Why? Oh, (laughs) because. That's fucking America in a nutshell, buddy. It really is. So, anyway, uh, that's quite a few minutes. Let's go ahead and see what that looks like. 